Today I'm going to show you how to solve your laptop not charging. So you plug it in the computer, but your battery isn't charging. What to do? Well, in this little video, I'll show you how to solve it. So let's dive into it. Well, here we have a couple of different laptops and I'm going to show you the different procedures on the different laptop. This is a fairly modern PC and this is an older one. And lastly, under it, we have a little bit more uh, middle. Anyways, this is the most modern kind. It's a kind of USB-C connector and it's connected and not charging. You can see there is no little uh, charging light lighting up there. So the USB-C connection is connected, but it refuses to charge. No lights are showing it. So what we have to do in this case is that we take the power button. This is the power button right there. And then you just hold it down, hold it down for 15 to 30 seconds. Uh, and when you do that, um, after that time, release it. And when you release it, you see that on caps lock, there was a little light lighting up there. It's different on different computers, but usually a little light somewhere on the PC would blink and say it's, um, it's reset. And now when we plug it again, we can see that the charging lights are showing and we can start the computer normally. Very nice and see indeed, you can see it just starts up like nothing happened. And under some computers, there is a reset hole. There is a little hole with a little uh, battery disconnection kind of uh, symbol. And there is usually close to the battery under the computer or at the side, it depends a little bit. But it's a little symbol and a little pinhole. Uh, this particular computer does not have a reset hole, but many do. And this computer that I also have, it indeed has a little reset hole, which we're going to use in order to reset the battery. So under the PC, you can see this little hole here, a little battery and disconnection little thing. And uh, inside here, we can stick in something. Like, you know, the thing you uh, take out SIM cards from the mobile, you can use that or you can use a paper clip like this. Just expand it and when you push it down carefully, make sure to put it straight down into the hole and you will feel a tiny little button. When you feel this little button, push it down and hold it down for 15 seconds or 30 seconds. And then you will be able to start a computer normally again. Then the battery should have been reset and the recharging issues should have been solved for most computers. And most computers do have a reset hole. However, computers that are a little bit older, like this one, uh, has a removable battery instead, and they do not have a reset hole like that. So in order to reset this computer, you just take out the battery like I just did. And now when we have taken out the battery completely from the computer, we can reset it by uh, using the power button. So we'll just flip the computer around, and uh, find a power button and hold it in for 15 to 30 seconds. Uh, 15 seconds is usually enough, but for some computers, 30 seconds is required. In any case, uh, that should be it. So uh, now we can just put in the battery again and we should indeed be able to charge the battery normally again. Well, hope it did solve your problem. And if it did solve it, well, then leave a like and do subscribe for future videos because we're back with tech tutorials every Tuesday. If this didn't solve your problem, then it might be possible that you actually need to open up the computer. Because in this case, I will guess that you have a computer that does not have a removable battery uh, and not the reset button. In this case, you will need to open, open up the computer and unplug the little battery connection inside of it. And that can be a little bit dangerous. And if you're very unused to opening up computers like this, um, maybe ask a professional to do it in order to not destroy it. Well, uh, it also is possible if you didn't find a reset button that you just missed it. Look an extra time and see if you can find that little reset hole somewhere. In any case, hope you enjoyed it. I'll see you next time. This is your host, Jim and I'm signing out.